Hi, I'm Drew Claiborne, and in today's tool tip, I want to show you how free software can expand the capabilities of your existing Mitutoyo SJ Surface Finish unit. Before we can begin, we're going to need two things. One, the free SJ communication tool, which can be downloaded from our website. If you haven't already downloaded the software, there's a link in the description below where you can go and download the free software from our website. And second, we're going to need a mini USB cable. This is just a commercially available cable. Once the software is downloaded, we'll begin with a zip file that contains everything we need to install the software. I'm going to open up this zip file to reveal the contents, and inside I have a folder which contains all of the installers. From here, I'm going to drag this folder to my desktop. Once we open this folder, now we can begin the installation by selecting the surftest SJ communication tool.msi file. Let's run the installer. Depending on which version of Windows you're running, you may get a message before the installer can begin. If so, select more information and select run anyway. Now we'll walk through the wizard that we use for the installation. Begin by pressing next. Unless changed, the software will be installed in the default directory here. Press next to continue. To begin installation, press the next button one more time. Once the installation is complete, let's press the close button. And now we'll connect the SJ unit to the USB cable. On the back of the SJ unit, I've already removed the cover panel. Now I'm going to take the mini USB cable and attach it to the USB port. Lastly, before running the software, we need to make sure that the drivers were successfully installed for the SJ unit. Just for good housekeeping, I'm going to go ahead and close out of the windows that are already open and return to my desktop. From here, I'm going to load the device manager. Once device manager is loaded, I notice right away that my SJ unit is not showing up. That's because the unit is not currently turned on. I'm going to press the power button on my SJ unit. And now you'll notice on my list is an SJ210, which has not had any drivers associated with it yet. To install the drivers for the SJ unit, I'm going to right click on the device marked SJ-210 and select update driver software. Next, I'm going to select browse my computer for driver software. Then I'll browse out to the location where the installer was extracted on my desktop. In this case, the folder is called SJ-210, 310, 410, USB. Select OK, and make sure the checkbox is selected that says Include Subfolders. Select Next to continue. Once the drivers are updated, you will receive this confirmation message. Press the Close button. Now we can close out of the Device Manager. Now I can load the newly installed SJ Communication Tool software. Normally the software will be launched through the start menu, but since this is Windows 8, there is no start menu. So to load the software, I'm going to select search, type SJ, and select the SJ Communication Tool from the top item on the search list. Now we're ready to use the software. If you'd like at this point, you can delete the installation files from the desktop, but before you do, Please note that in the extracted folder, there is a PDF manual for the software. Thank you for watching today's tool tip. Again, please remember that the link to download the software is in the description below. And also, don't forget the micro USB cable. One other item that I need to mention to you is that Microsoft Excel is required for reporting from the USB communication tool. If this video is helpful, feel free to like, share this video, leave comments below if you have suggestions for future tool tips. If you have any other questions, please feel free to call us at 888 Mitutoyo or visit us online at www.mitutoyo.com.